Hey folks, Matt from IreTheImage.com. Got a great question in from uh, Manu Pratap. I think that's how you pronounce it. He says, could you please tell me which mic you are using for shooting YouTube videos? It would be appreciable. One more thing, can I use this mic to shoot short movies with boom poles? Well, I'm assuming you're talking about this mic because this comment is on one of the videos where it's this setting in, in the studio with this setup. So I'm assuming it's this mic you're asking about. And this mic is the Audio-Technica AT2020. It's actually listed in the equipment list below, but I'll put a link below, right below in the video description for you to check it out on Amazon. It's a very good mic. This one's an XLR mic. I believe they call this a large condenser mic, I think was the description. But these are very highly rated. You'll see that on Amazon, very high ratings. Um, uh, this is XLR cable. You can get it in a USB, the same mic, in an AT20 USB format. The XLR allows me to go out to a Zoom H4. That's what this is right here. So the Zoom H4 has XLR inputs and allows you, I don't know if you could see from there, but it's actually recording. It's recording this audio. So what that does is two things, actually. Um, I can sync that with a cord right to the camera, which I'm not doing right now. Uh, I'm recording to an SD card, and then I take the SD card and I sync the audio in Premiere Pro, which has an auto sync feature, and it works great. So this mic recorded into the Zoom H4. The Zoom H4 does very high quality audio recording. Um, you can record it as WAV files or MP3s, and you can set it to very high recording levels. Uh, and that's where you get the sound quality is, I would say, mostly from the mic, but then the Zoom H4 is not letting you down either because it's recording a good file. But this is a really good sounding mic. It's my favorite one. And I'm liking the um, the extension I have. This is a newer swing arm extension. I'll put a link for that for you below too. So um, that's the mic I use almost all the time. Sometimes I'll use my little Zoom H1. I'm testing the Tascam DR05 handheld right now. I very rarely use the Zoom H4 by itself without a mic, even though it has very good mics on it, simply because they're more exposed. And if I'm not in the studio, I worry about damaging them because I do know people that have dropped them and damaged them. But short answer is this is the Audio-Technica AT 2020. And uh, I'll put a link below. You can check it out. Thanks for your question. Thanks for tuning in, folks. We'll be back soon here at artoftheimage.com.